Welcome to Bolt Energy USA. This is the Candy Cruiser and the Coleman DRV48 lithium battery conversion video. To begin, put your key in the off position and remove the lead acid AGM batteries. The standard installation kit is recommended for these vehicles. However, you will need to replace the main battery cables, which you will have to purchase separately. Using an 8mm socket, remove the four mounting bolts of the OEM charge receptacle. Locate the charger input quick connection. Disconnect and free the wiring harness. Remove and discard the receptacle. Secure the Bolt Energy USA cover plate with the provided mounting hardware. Insert and secure the AC port to the cover plate with the three provided screws. Remove the OEM charger output wires and route back to the charger. The charger is located behind the dash panel. Unbolt and remove the OEM charger. On the cart side of the harness, there are two plugs, one two pin and one three pin. The two pin with the white and blue wires is the charger interlock. At this point, go ahead and secure the charger in the battery compartment. This is the charger interlock wire out of the Bolt Energy USA charger. This safety feature will keep the charger interlock feature active and not allow the golf cart to operate while plugged in. Route the charger's input wire and plug it into the AC port. Next, route the charger interlock wire harness from the charger's signal port up towards the dash. Extend the charger interlock wire from any of the three ends and route to the dash area. Use the wire straps to secure all wires running up to the dash area. It's hard to see with the heat shrink covering the wires, but we connected the extended red charger interlock wire to the white charger interlock wire from the golf cart's harness. Note, make sure to cap off or insulate the blue wire from the golf cart's harness, as well as the two unused ends on the bolt charger interlock wire. This golf cart will need to have the existing battery cables replaced with longer cables to reach the Bolt Energy USA battery terminals. Remove the OEM battery cables using a 13mm socket or wrench. Note, the smaller red and black wires on the controller's post is the 48 volt supply for the OEM 12 volt reducer and should remain in place. We recommend adding the Bolt Energy USA 2 gauge main battery cables to your standard installation kit. Secure the new Bolt Energy USA main battery cables using a 13 mm socket and torque wrench. Tighten to 11 foot pounds or 132 inch pounds. The battery tray will need to be slightly modified. Using a grinder, cut the battery hold down brackets on each side of the battery tray level with the rim of the tray. This will allow the bracket to slide back enough to properly align with the battery. Mark the center of each bracket's mounting slots. Next, drill four mounting holes. Insert the provided mounting hardware and hand tighten. Measure 14 inches from mounting hole to mounting hole. Tighten the mounting hardware using a 13 mm socket and wrench. Set the battery on top of the mounting brackets and tighten using the provided 13 mm hardware. The battery is extremely secure with no room for movement. Plug in the state of charge meter wiring harness into the display port on the battery. Route the other end of the wiring harness to the dash area. Secure the wire above the bottom of the cart's frame. Select an area on the dash for the state of charge meter. For this model, it may be useful to utilize a vertical mounting bracket. 
Pull the state of charge wiring harness through the hole and connect it to the meter. Slide the meter into the dash or bracket and secure it with the provided U-shaped bracket and wing nut. Secure the excess wire in the compartment and reinstall the dash panel. First, plug the charger pigtails into the charger output wire by clicking it into place. Starting on the positive side, go smallest to biggest, biggest touching the post. The smallest wire is the positive wire from the charger pigtail, and the largest wire is the new main positive cable. Tighten to 11 foot-pounds or 132 inch-pounds with a 13 millimeter socket and torque wrench. Same for the negative side, the smallest is the black wire from the charger pigtail, followed by the main negative cable from the controller. Again, using your 13 millimeter socket and torque wrench, Tighten to 11 foot-pounds or 132 inch-pounds. Insert the terminal covers to prevent cross-terminal arcing. To finalize your installation, plug the Bluetooth adapter into the BT port on the battery. Go ahead and test cart operation. Once you've verified cart operation, it is recommended to run a complete charge cycle before using the battery. Plug in your Bolt Energy USA charging extension cord into your 120 volt outlet. Plug the other end of the extension cord into the newly replaced AC port to activate the onboard charger. It will run a complete charge cycle and shut off when finished. While you're waiting for your battery to max charge, we recommend downloading the Bolt Energy USA mobile application from the Android or iOS app stores. The Bolt app connects your mobile phone to your battery via a Bluetooth connection and shows battery data in real time. The update firmware feature allows your Bolt battery to be updated via your Bluetooth and wireless connection. This feature keeps your battery up to date with current settings in the rare event of an update. The best part of the app will probably never need to be used. The Send Data feature allows the battery's data log to be sent to a Bolt Energy USA technician for diagnosis in the rare event of a warranty claim. Thank you for choosing Bolt Energy USA, the best lithium golf cart battery on the planet. We hope this video answered all of your questions. If you need additional information or would like to purchase a Bolt Energy USA battery, please visit the links in the description of this video. We recommend the dealer locator link to find a local authorized dealer near you or a reputable online dealer. You can also reach out to us directly through our social media accounts, website, or call us during normal business hours. As always, thank you for being a part of the Bolt Energy USA team. We appreciate you watching, and we hope to see you next time. Thank you.